Hi, my name is Terry, and this is how to go kart faster on the Pinnacle Go Kart track. Today, we're going to talk about the braking points, the acceleration points, and the very, very secret racing lines of Amir Harris, three time Rotex Asia champion. And make sure you stay till the end of the video because you're going to see a POV shot of his racing lines. Alrighty, T1. The light pole there, way over there, that's your first braking marker. You want to start to brake right before that light pole. From the brake at the light pole, you want the trail brake, which is keep on the brake all the way down to the apex. And from the apex, you want to get back onto the throttle, power out on the outside line at the exit. You want to get as close as you want at the apex, but you do not want to go over the curbs. From here, get on the throttle, power out, all the way out to the curb on the exit. T2, you want to take as much of a straight line as possible. Get on the outside line. You can eat a little bit of the curb, just a little bit. Two tires right on the curb. This is a little bit of a tire mark right on the grass. So don't be afraid to get just two tires right on the grass to get your straight line. Always a straight line. Along this straight line towards T2. T2, you want to hit that apex but avoid that curb. Remember, it's a full throttle all the way from T1. Full throttle all the way to T3. Straight line, keep your cart as straight as possible. But before the next turn, I just want to give a shout out to our sponsor, Schooling Malaysia. They've been very supportive of us to creating content and our races. And they've given us this uh, beautiful slow juicer blender for every one of our events. We give free juices for all of our contestants. Really smooth, unique taste, and they really preserve the taste of these fruits. And just want to say thank you, Kuvings Malaysia, for all your support and looking to work with you for years and years on end. Thank you very much. Okay, T3 is a double apex, very long corner. Take this turn, full throttle, but make sure you hit two apexes. Remember, for T3, on the first apex, there are bumps on either side of the road. You want to take this little spot here because you want to conserve the speed and avoid any of these bumps. Straight line speed through the first apex, all the way out to the middle and then back to the second apex. Remember, full throttle! Speed! This is the second apex of T3. You want to keep a straight line hitting this apex, exiting straight to the cement part of T4. T4, this is where you want to break. There are no braking points here, so try your best to brake at least 6 meters from the curb. You want to brake hard in the beginning and trail brake all the way down to the apex and then get back onto the throttle. Remember at C4, you will be hitting the apex at high speeds. Ensure smooth steering. You don't want to turn too much, just a little bit. Slow down, hit that apex, get back onto the throttle and exit right to the middle line. Remember, exit of T4, you want to land right here. Because if you land here, you're too fast! Towards T5, you want to stick to the middle line. Stick to the middle line. This time, you want to hit the curb with all four wheels. On T5, you want to get all four wheels right onto this curb. No braking, no lifting, full throttle. Right on the exit of T5, you want to land half of your cart on the cement. You do not want to land right onto the grass. <laughs> On T6, you want to have to pay attention to where the road starts to change color because this is where you want to start to turn in. As you are turning in, you want to be in the middle of the track, full throttle all the way down to the apex. As you approach the apex of T6, you want to give a little bit of a lift just before the apex, turn in and then right back onto the throttle, exit on the outside line. Right on the exit of T6, you want to land right here. You do not want to land on the cement part because if you do, you're too fast. Why are you here? On T7, you want to take this corner with full throttle right on the middle line. This corner is an uphill corner, so you have to keep your throttle down the entire way to conserve your RPMs. This is the late apex of T7. You want to get as close to the curb as possible, but do not touch it and exit right onto the cement area. If you like this tutorial, give this video a like, give this channel a subscription so we can make more tutorials for you, more contents to the video. And now, back to the video. T7 to T8, you want to exit right here along the cement area. You want to drive a straight line along the curb and just graze the grass. From T7 to T8, you want to land right in the middle of the track 
and pay attention to the change of color on the road again. This is where you want to lift, turn in straight to the apex. This is the apex of T8. You want to get back right onto the throttle just before the apex of T8. From T8 to T9, you want to end up right in the middle of the track, full throttle, hit the apex of T9. Right after T9, you want to take the outer line, follow along the track, full throttle, down the straight, and back to T1. And there you have it. Those are the braking points, the acceleration points, and the secret racing lines. And now Amir is going to show us how it's done. Go, 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 go!